Okay, I'm here today to do a real short review on this Turnigy USB charger with the XT60 connector. Now the website says this this will take between a 2 and 6x 6s battery. Um, it only has voltage protection for a 2s or 3s battery, and its output is supposed to be 2,000 milliamp hours, and it also says 2 amps. So the question is, does it perform? So the first question I have is, does it work? Right. So let's take a battery. This is a three cell 2100 fully charged, plug it in, and that was not expected. Let's try this other one, plug it in, here we go, we got a red light. Just ignore that first one because I know this works. Um, we have a red light here indicating it's working, God, I hope that one's still working, anyway. Um, so first test is to plug this in and plug into my cell phone. And I've got a little app here on my cell phone which shows uh, battery charging and it also shows the rate that it's charging at. So if you can see here, it shows 480 milliamp hours. Let's see if that's any clearer there. 480 milliamp hours. Now it said 2,000 milliamp hours. Um, so I'm a little confused. It's 480 for one port. I could see if it was maybe a thousand, then they could say a thousand for each port. So let me switch ports. And oops, it's charging 479. So if you ask me, this is a half amp charger. Um, so does it work? Yes. Can you charge your cell phone with it? Yes. Can you charge a small camera, camera like a, a Mobius or a keychain cam with it? Absolutely. Is it any better than one of these? Well, that depends. Um, these are more portable. I don't worry. I wouldn't worry about putting one of these in my pocket and carrying it around um, for at home or at the flying field. Uh, you, you get the advantage of larger batteries. Does it do what it's supposed to do? No. And here's the problem. I have, I bought this specifically for a Blackberry Playbook. Uh, we have a couple of those, the kids have them. And to charge those, things like this that only put out a half an amp, won't work. So I was really hoping that the 2 amp output would be enough to charge it. But it's obviously not 2 amp output. I'm going to try this other one again just to, just to verify that we actually have a light on it. I'm also starting starting to be afraid that this has died already. This is day one, by the way. I opened these up earlier today. Really? Nothing? Let's test the battery. Oh, there's... Oh, that's definitely a problem. My battery... I'm not going to touch that. Battery connectors, obviously. Come undone on that battery. Let's try over here. There we go, we got the red light. So it's not the fault of this, it's the fault of my, uh, my battery. So I've got to fix that. I don't want to fly with that. It's amazing. Anyway, quality soldering on that. So uh, buyer beware, you're not actually getting a 2 amp USB charger, you're getting a half amp USB charger. Possibly uh, if it'll do two different devices them. I'm sorry that I don't have two devices down here, two cell phones to measure each of them. Uh, it's possible that it's one amp total and you can do two at once, which would be just slightly better. Um, but it's definitely not what is advertised on the site. Price is good. It's uh, seven bucks, I think. And it uh, makes use of some of your batteries that you have lying around. Just be aware that it's not going to charge a two amp device or even a one amp device. Anyway, that's it for now. Take care.